rain. There's a completely different Venice Beach that most people don't see. There's no tourists, there's no artists, there's the occasional surfer, there's no scooters. Mostly, it's homeless people. Homeless people don't have any place to go out here. Can you imagine living in a tent and it's raining all day and it's going to rain for days here in Los Angeles? Imagine living in a tent and you do not have resources like refrigeration, Wi-Fi, a bathroom. Homelessness isn't fun. It's not camping. It's survival. People are surviving out here on the streets in the pouring rain. Compared to the weekends when there's basically a circus out here in Venice. It's, you literally, literally. I find Venice out in the rain kind of eerie, kind of lonely, but heartbreaking. There's hundreds of homeless people right here sleeping and they don't have any place to go. This is homelessness. In places like Skid Row, it's even more devastating when the rain comes like it is this week. We have to end homelessness. We have to do something to get these people off the streets into housing. I mean, if you don't have a heart of compassion, as a taxpayer, you're paying huge money for people being out here. Housing people saves lives and saves money. We have to end homelessness. Please, when it comes to policy change in your neighborhood, advocate, fight for more affordable housing, fight for more resources for homeless people. We have to help these people. We have to end homelessness. It's not just the right thing to do, it's the fiscally responsible thing to do. I don't see how anyone in Los Angeles can drive around when it's raining and see all the homeless people trying to survive if they're lucky and tense. I mean, everything gets wet out here and you don't have a dryer to just go and you know get normal again. I've made many good friends out here in Venice and it breaks my heart that Walter and his wife are sleeping out here in a tent during this rainstorm. Hi. Hey Walter, my goodness, I am so sad you're out here in the rain. Um, well, uh, there's a lot of other people out here in the rain. Uh, there's a lot of things you got to realize, uh, you know, whether you're in a tent or not, when you're out here and homeless, you got to find a spot that is dry. Because if you're not dry, you freeze. Because the ground temperature that you're close to laying down is cooler than when you add rain to that, the body temperature goes down even yeah. further. Yeah. So when you're cold, you're wet. And everything gets wet. Yeah, everything gets wet. And your clothes get wet, you can freeze. Yeah. It's hard. It's hard on your your mind. It's hard on your bones. It's hard on your skin. And it's going to rain for days. And it's going to be raining for days. And My heart uh, breaks for you. Um, I should, uh, my heart goes out for all of us. Yeah. A homeless man was just walking by and he's carrying a big piece of cardboard and a suitcase and he just gave up.
pretty much all you can do is the best you can to survive. Some people try to make the best of it. Here's my friend Dakota, who I saw out skateboarding in the rain through the puddles. Dakota, I, you, I just saw you skating through puddles. Yes. You're having fun. I'm trying to, I'm already wet, so might as well enjoy the moment, so. Uh, I mean. It's gotta be horrible out here when it's wet like this. It does, it does, but that's why you try to make the best of it. Go through puddles. Yeah. <laughs> now, are you in a tent or where are you staying? Um, I recently had my tent stolen from me, thrown away, one, one or the other, I don't know, but it was recently taken from me, so I've been seeking shelter in other people's tents. Oh my gosh. Yeah, and all my clothes are wet now, so it's like. Everything well, gets wet out here. Yeah. Might as well wait until tomorrow to get dry. Yeah. <laughs> well, it's supposed to rain for a couple of days. I know. I know. Oh my gosh. That's why I'm like, man. Just recording an Instagram story, and here's my friend Mark, and I just adore Mark, and he's always so nice, um, and he calls me the preacher. I tell him I'm not a preacher, but then he says, but you pray real good. Breaks my heart that he's making a bed to sleep, but at least he's going to stay dry. Tell me about being in the rain here. We're like being home and you know rain is it's the worst time of the, of the season for us you know we have we have to take care of our little stuff our things that we have and you know most of all you know we, we depend on, on, on the people who, who have uh, uh, things such as this you know uh, garages that they're not living in or that they're using or, or apartments that have uh, garages and, and, and yeah we, yeah you, you, and you, you know we have to have to you know have a certain standard by ourselves and and some of the people you know most of the people they, they let us homeless people get by but we really do need some help out, out, out here in this world you know we need someone to uh come in you know and speak for us and 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 just go and uh, muster the money up and, and, and put up some 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 nice uh, uh facility for us and then let us do something for the community if we work Eight oh, hours a day. Mark, you are free. so smart. If we just work free, just we'll, we'll pay for our housing. Yeah. You know, if we would ask for money, would you just give us two or three hundred dollars of a stamp? Yeah. And our you want you want out of this? Yes, I want out of it. One of the things I always get a kick out of is you call me preacher, and I tell you I'm not a preacher, well, see, but then you say, well, but you pray good or you do good. You, you I'm not a preacher. But you come with that that you know how preachers come. They come with that hard nose, like a oh, Mark. Oh, you can do this. Now, you know, I know you can do it. Like, like you have seen it done. I'll be like, preacher, well, 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 where he is that guy at so I can get in with yeah. me? Well, I know I know him. Yeah. But you never say where he is. You know, I love you guys for that. You give yeah. us most confidence. You're so cool. Well, you're it. awesome, Mark. You well, stay dry, man. I, I'm trying. I'm trying. You stay trying. dry. Yes, sir. No one in this great country of ours should be homeless. We know how to end homelessness. We've known for years. The problem is we need public support to do it. Please advocate for more affordable housing. And please advocate for more supportive housing. And we need more support services. We need to get these people off the streets. Homelessness isn't a punishment for bad decisions. If it was, we'd all be homeless. If you learn something from this video, click like. It helps YouTube feed it to more people. Please click subscribe and please support us on Patreon. We need your help to continue telling these stories that nobody else is telling and empowering homeless people to share their own stories. It's because of you that Invisible People is even possible. You make Invisible People happen. Thank you. Thank you.